There is a location. Um, this is the parking lot. Mm -hmm. we got, we've got we have our work for that yeah, day. Yeah. Uh, That's eyebrows. Yeah. Yeah. Did you? Yeah. yeah. Oh, good. They want his upper lip to, to pull up and, and disappear so you can see the all his teeth. I've got a ball sort of as far away as I could get it, and then one right up front. And um, I think if I shorten these and get this ball to be sort of more up here, then I'll be able to get like a more sort of expressive like mm, shape. They're like, you really need it to go everywhere. And it's gonna, it's gonna, you're gonna have to kind of baby you know, these corner of the mouth things with it. But yeah, you're gonna be able to get like, like way over there, you know. Hmm. You should around him. <laughs> yeah, that's cool.
such a liar. I'm, I'm not making this up, I swear. She talks to me all the time. Oh, yeah? Prove it. She said it's not very ladylike to hide photos of the high school quarterback with his shirt off in your underwear drawer. You little creep. I am going to strangle you. You've been going through my stuff. No, I haven't. Grandma told me. Oh, Norman, you are ruining my life. We have to keep trying. We tried, and look what happened. I'm scared, Norman, okay? I can't listen to this anymore. You never listen. No one ever listens. I'm scared too, but I've still got to do this. Wh what, are you, what are you gonna do? Ask the zombies not to eat you? I should have known you wouldn't understand. No one ever does. Norman, you need to stop all this weird stuff and start living in the real world. Everyone in the real world thinks I'm a freak. Well, you know what? Maybe they're right. Maybe I am a freak. But I never ask for your help. Just go! Everyone get out! Salma! We need to find out where the witch is buried! I went to the old graveyard, but her grave wasn't there! You know, I would Google it myself if there wasn't a 300-year-old dead guy hanging upside down the roof trying to tear my face off! Is this when he's on stage? Um, yeah. Uh, he's, uh, it's the play rehearsal. Mm -hmm. So it's it's the bit when he's kind of like stood there and he really probably doesn't want anything to do with this play, but he's on stage and he's doing his... I know this is going to be a struggle for you, Cody, but he's not a great actor. <laughs> so he's he's I projecting, can... but he's doing it in that kind of like middle school, yeah. I'm the narrator kind of way. Yeah. The founding fathers of Blythe Hollow discovered an evil witch amongst them. The founding fathers of of Blythe Hollow discovered an evil witch um, amongst them. Uh, we did listen to you, and look what happened. I deal with cheerleader pyramids and emoticons and boys with names like Brick. Not ghosts and ghouls and witches. Uh, we listened to you, and look what happened. I'm just a really popular cheerleader with a smoking hot body. I can't deal with ghosts and ghouls and witches. Oh, wow, that's great. Your brother and my brother are like best friends. I'm Courtney. No, it's fine. He sucks. But I, I gotta make sure he doesn't like die or anything tonight. Will you help me? Please? Could you? Could you just throw in, I just thought another one is like, oh, this is awful, the zombies are like eating everybody. Okay, yeah. It's like a really classic one. Okay. <gasps> oh, this is awful! The zombies are like eating everyone! Oh, this is awful! The zombies are like eating everyone! Oh, this is awful! The zombies are like eating everyone. Everybody listen up! You all need to stop trying to kill my brother! You're grown-ups! Stop it! I know that this seems crazy. You guys, I am with you on that, believe me. But, okay, but maybe he does actually know what he's talking about. So do I. Uh Let's do it together. You shouldn't let them get you down. They always do stuff like that to me. I've been like Alvin a million times. Neil, isn't he that weird kid? You know, the, look at me, I talk to ghosts so people will pay attention to me. No one pays attention to me, so I talk to ghosts. Look at me, I talk to ghosts so people will pay attention to me. Look at me, I talk to ghosts so people will pay attention to me. <laughs> Neil! Will you get the door? Are you freeze-framing Mom's aerobics DVD again? It's disgusting, Neil! Then would it kill you to get off your butt and answer the door? It's not easy taking a shower! Neil? Yeah, Neil's my brother. Hey, Neil! You come here a minute? 
There's a girl asking for you. Better start talking, buddy. But that place is bad news. Total slasher movie vibe. Why'd he go up there? Everybody says he's a loser. Sorry, but they do. Guys! There's something moving out there. Zombies at four o'clock or six o'clock. Oh, no, it's not. It's just grown ups. Those are grown ups. Guys, they're just grown ups. Wait, they are zombies. Oh, no, they're grown ups. They're grown ups. They are grown ups. And could you give me like a prolonged effort noise as he's pushing the, this huge set of shelves in front of the town hall door? Uh, okay, uh, listen up. Uh, uh, just, uh, okay, listen up. Uh, uh, all right, someone else say something. Uh, ah. Uh, that's good, that's good. Just give it up, Wiener. We've had enough of this. Oh, brother, just give it up, Wiener. Seriously, we've had enough of this. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Look at that idiot! <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. <laughs> oh! I'm just gonna be honest with you guys because we're all really best friends now. I pee my pants. I think I just wet myself like a tiny, just a skosh. I think I wet myself a skosh. I know, I'm getting into it. Ah! Yeah, yeah. Oh God, get it off me! It's so cold. It's so gross and dead. Ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. No! Please spare our souls. I beg of you. Please spare my. Ah. Ah. I can see ghosts too. Never told you that, did they? <laughs> I can see ghosts too. Never told you that, did they? <laughs> Things you can't quite explain. Pieces of the past burning through from the other side. Strange faces peering through the veil. Bad omens, a lot of them. That's great. Yeah. Things you Go can't on. quite explain. Pieces of the past burning through from the other side. Strange faces peering through the veil. Your brother's name was Casper. Casper. Perry, calm down. I don't want to. You have high blood pressure and it's not good for you. Calm down. It's your family that makes me crazy. My family is completely normal. If you don't believe in things like astrology, then you're the crazy one. I don't believe in astrology. Why should I believe in astrology? Because only dumb people don't believe in astrology. When did astrology have anything to do with intelligence? Perry, calm down. All right, I'm calmed down. I'm calming. I really think it might help if you try to see things from his point of view. I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't believe in the afterlife or astrology. Don't be ridiculous, okay? It's, 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 it's not the afterlife. It's like, I mean, not believing in the afterlife is like not believing in astrology. What's with your mom? Every time we go over there, she puts out a bowl of raisins. Who puts out a bowl of raisins? Raisins are very good for you. I'm not saying they're not. Just a weird choice to put in a bowl of raisins on a table. Well, maybe she's trying to tell you something. What, that I should not have... Uh... That you need more raisins. <laughs> maybe I do need more raisins. <laughs> You villainous youth! You stink of illiteracy! Pilgrims! The Mayflower! Don't any of you know anything about the history of this town? Oh, insufferable amateurs! Oh, insufferable amateurs! Oh, you foul, wretched ruffians! For the last time, Puritans were strict and devout settlers who came here to build a home, a place without sin. What is it now, Selma? 
It's not supposed to be! It's supposed to sell postcards and keychains. So let's try it again. Top of page six, Norman. Seven of them in all, to die a horrible and gruesome death, and rise from their graves as the living dead. <laughs> their souls, their souls doomed to an eternity of damnation. <laughs> Dumb kids with their cell phones burning up the ozone. That's what this is. That's good. Let's, let's get pesky. <sighs> pesky kids with their cell phones burning up the ozone. That's what this is. <sighs> pesky kids with their cell phones burning up the ozone. That's what this is. Would have been a quiet night, too, if it hadn't been for those meddling kids. Hmm. <laughs> Hey guys, here's today's daily fact. Now for the film The Labyrinth, the owl in the title sequence is computer generated. Now this is the first attempt at a photorealistic CGI animal in a full length feature film. Hmm, not bad. Now remember to click here below to subscribe or on the side for more great content.